Hello, this is Trevor. Today we're doing another XSS lab in Port Swigger's Web Security Academy. This time it's a reflected XSS with AngularJS Sandbox Escape Without Strings. So uses it in an unusual way where the eval function is not available and you will be unable to use any string strings in AngularJS Solve Lab Perform a cross-site scripting attack that escapes the sandbox and executes the alert function without using the eval function. Okay, so this is another lab where I was unable to solve it on, on my own and did look at the solution. And so I figured in this video, we're just going to talk through what they did, why they did it, and how it works. Uh, let's go here so here's the full solution just copied and here it is decoded right so right here we have a uh, one ampersand this should be able to be anything this is just a search so like if we put a this should still work i don't want to search it quite yet because it's going to solve it um I want so I'm gonna leave this until the end, but we use this two string function just and this is going this is without using any single or double quotes, but allows us to create a string, right? So we so we've got now a string in replace of this, so it's essentially doing this one ampersand this dot constructor dot prototype dot char at equals dot join the same this if you look at uh sorry we're going to delete that if you look at this it is the same as what's in the sandbox right here just without the a Right, same single quotes dot constructor dot prototype dot char at equals open square bracket close dot join. All right, so that's the first part. And and this is going to let us get past the original filter um, that we talk about here. Okay, so next we have the order by and again this is talked about here where we can use instead of using eval we're doing this order by right so we've got this compared to or order by this part compared to let me just copy it order by or no it's right here order by this instead of the example I had one two three the bitwise or but in this case in angular js it talks about how this is a filter and then it has order by and the colon which is sending it to the filter and again we can't use strings so in the example in the instructions it has some string here but we can do the same by using two string in dot constructor so if i just right click inspect go to console and i do two string dot constructor i have the string function right and then with that i have the ability to do the if i do dot here you can see from char code there and then inside the char code we get we can build out a string that we get passed to the filter hope that makes sense the string is just ASCII hex, you know, decimal represent ASCII hex representations of the 
characters we want to do. So I Python. If I do, um, let's do a equals. I don't know. Let's do a list. Let's show you what this is first. So I'm going to copy all of this, paste it here in that list. I'm going to do four X in a and word or char. So I want char a char X and I'm going to uh, print it or you know what I can do instead. I can do list comprehension, so I can do X for, no, I want char X for X in A, and then I can do bup bup dot join this. And you can see, here's the output. So, and just real quick, this is, uh, list comprehension so I'm substituting the variable x for each character in a for each item in this list and then I'm running the char function on it which turns a decimal into the ASCII character and then I'm joining that list back to a, a, a phrase so here's what that shows x equals alert one I don't know exactly. We'll have to play why the X is necessary, but let's try to do our console.log so we can play with this. Um, I'm going to do B equals X equals console.log one like that. And then I'll do the opposite. So B so I'm going to do ord x for x in b. That should work. Perfect. There we go. I don't want the spaces, though. We have a limitation on how much room we have. So let me paste this here. This will be our console log. I'm going to delete all of these. Perfect. And then I'm going to take all of this. Actually, I'm going to do it this one because see how this one has certain characters URL encoded. So I'm going to take advantage of that by copying this, pasting it there. And we just need the, we need to delete these and add in one. Okay, so let's check that out. Copy. Let's go here. Is our lab still live? Uh, please remember to like and subscribe. Leave a comment. Let me know how I'm doing. I don't know if I said that already, but so apologize if I said it twice. So I want this to actually go here, right? Um, except for I want it on the search. So I'm going to search for one. Search. And then here's where I want the and. I can't remember if we already had. Nope. I already had that. So search equals one. Hey, look at that. We, we got something here and we caused this huge error here. Which I didn't honestly know if that would work, but that is cool. What we don't have I think in ours is that x equals, do we? Oh, we do x equals.
equals ours is exactly the same one twenty and forty one so I'm just looking for where I may have messed up so try join one pipe order by two string constructor dot from char code everything looks okay to me did I not I did it in the right spot it just did not like something I did and I did console.log one That's the dot. Maybe the dot screwed it up. I don't know what screwed it up. But. Oh, look at this. Security search one, two string. Construct a prototype. Join. That looks all right. Invalid assignment left hand side compile. Invalid assignment left hand side. We do, they have 12061, which is the x equals, and we have the same. They just do alert, and we do console.log and equals one we have that it shouldn't be url encoded this should be and this equal should not be man i don't know that looks right to me it, sh it looks like it should work Search searching one and this. It looks like we're starting to get there, but there's at least something we're not doing right. And maybe and unfortunately I don't know. Alright, let's see uh what else we got here. Is there anything else we want to talk about? I think we covered everything. This first thing shouldn't matter. Like I said, the two string matters. All of this course matters. This shouldn't matter. We could put any set of numbers here we want. Two string dot constructor. All of this. This part allows us to do this part, which is building the string without quotes and then we're passing this string to the order by filter which is then running it because of our because of how we uh, modified this part here it bypasses the sandbox and gets executed all right, so let's just solve it. Um, how do we want to solve this? I'm gonna do create our scripts, which we will name Angular Sandbox Escape Without Strings, Vim. I don't know what's going on. Vim Angular Sandbox Escape Without strings.py I'll grab our template we just need to search and I'm not going to do anything real special here I think I'm just going to copy the so blog 
No, we want... We can do blog.getResponse. URL. URL equals blog dot base URL plus let's get the search part so it's just this and this plus payload and let's just find our payload here I'll need either single or double it doesn't matter so we'll do double quotes and we're going to put this there. It's too long, so I'll break it up just to make it so that Python is happy. So I'll put parentheses here. I'll find a spot like right here. I think that's a good spot. Finally found a good spot. And then we'll close that there. Those should be happy. And then we'll do blog dot is solved. Comment out requests. I think that's it. D Python ang angular. And we want home there. Paste this and see how we did. Lab is solved. So we did end up solving it with the alert. I'm a little disappointed that we weren't able to get console.log running. And I don't know why. So I'm going to have to try to spend some time if I can to figure out why every, with everything else the same while the, why this worked. Um, let's do now that we've solved it let's grab this copy and check it out so we want uh one i don't get an alert here and i think i should so it's not us or console.log it just does not work maybe it's Firefox let's open up another Chrome I'm gonna try it just here hey that worked so this does not work in Firefox. Let's try our console.log now in Chrome. Now to be fast because this is gonna time out on me very soon. Inspect console. Cannot create it on interesting. So I'm gonna full screen. Well, let me move this off of the screen so we get a little bit more room. So we have an arrow with the oh, but we do look at this. We get one there. Yes. So that did work. Awesome. So we did understand it and did end up making it work. Sweet. Well, that's it uh, for this video. If you have any questions, definitely let me know. This was an interesting one. Didn't work in Firefox. So everything I was trying, uh, just it would not have worked even if I had known what I was doing. So I want this one to go to window one. But in Chrome, it worked. We got both the alert box and the console log that we saw. So anyways, if you have any questions, definitely let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Goodbye.